as of tomorrow. But by the time you see this, we'll be ready to lock down. And yeah, I don't know what to say really because there was me at the beginning going, "Oh, I got a shield for 12 weeks, and we got a lockdown." And at, like, at the time I was not like, really annoyed, but like, it's, uh, with the stuff we've been through this year, by now it's just like, "What? Who cares, really?" Like, I've been shielding anyway. Um, you see where where everyone's struggled this year and what everyone's been through and it's well done to have made it this far. I don't mean that in like a go at people who, who suffered with Covid or anything or lost because of Covid. I mean like in general, if you made it this far, well done. If you're unscathed, that's not true. Everyone got a few scrapes and bumps and bruises throughout this year. If Covid, if you didn't catch Covid, it affected you in some way, mentally or your freedom or you know, like me, my freedom in some ways affected that a lot. Your, your confidence of normal life, that your understanding of normal life for anyone. So I'm going to roll the clips from me getting the vaccine yesterday. Um, if you don't like needles, look away and don't watch it, uh, basically. Go ahead. So first of all, I need to confirm you are here for your COVID-19 vaccine. Yeah. Perfect. Is it your first dose? Yeah. Brilliant. Medications from the doctor. I'm particularly interested if you take aspirin or any blood thinners. Um, no. Good. Um, have you got any significant allergies to any medications or foods? Not that I know of, no. No? Fantastic. Have you had any other vaccines in the past seven days? No. Okay, very important question now. Have you tested positive to COVID in the past 28 days? No. Is it all good to go? Yeah. Yeah? All right, so we're doing this arm yeah. here, aren't we? So that's all right. So you're having the AstraZeneca Oxford vaccine, is that cool with you? Yeah, that's right. Lovely. All right, let's do it. Okay. Relax for me. You're all done. Wow. Yeah, how I don't know that? Just like a normal jam. Oh, I don't do needles, that's the thing. Oh, it's fine. Did it hurt or anything? <laughs> I'm pretty tough with this sort of thing. Yeah, yeah no, I, I don't do needles. Used to it. So many blood tests over the years. Yeah. Um, I'm going to do the same. Ah, welcome back, guys. What a time to be alive, guys. Um, I finally got my vaccine. Finally, the first dose of the vaccine. And, yeah, my arm's a bit sore, but that's about it. Um, brilliant. Like, brilliant news. Finally. It's been a year of, like, not being able to do anything normal. N n for none of us, but more so for me, being in that vulnerable category. But I hate using that word, because it really doesn't describe me as a person. Um, but this vaccine just gives everyone that hope, you know, that things will get better. Um, yeah, it's a vaccine, it's not a cure. Uh, don't get it mixed up and nothing is guaranteed, doesn't mean you, you, you're immune completely. We don't know, but it is a good sign. The future is bright, guys. And I'll tell you now, this is a great step in the right direction. And I've got a bit of footage from when I got the vaccine done. Uh, my brother freaked out because he hates needles because he was filming it, so that's pretty funny. Um, the camera angles are terrible because um, you don't really want to film people in the pharmacy, do you? Um, but yeah, speaking of where I got it done, it was a local pharmacy. Um, I had the choice of there or a big vaccination centre where there's loads of people that is at a risk. So I thought, go to somewhere quiet, local, and it was quiet and peaceful, because I thought it would be a mess. I thought it would be just people queuing up down the street, but it wasn't. Um, and if you had yours done, you know how it feels. If you haven't yet, um, don't be scared. I mean, I haven't got any superpowers, which is annoying. Um, I haven't lost any limbs. I'm still here, so it's fine. Um, I don't know if there's a microchip in me, if Wi-Fi is incorporated, or they injected some 5G into me. But there's enough rumours going around the last year, and if anything I've learned is just like there's so much crap on the internet that you need to ignore and you know social media and all that 
you really just got to be yourself. I mean, that's the thing I've learned the last year, and for a lot of people, that's been the most difficult thing. They've had a lot of time alone and time to address who they really are, what they're doing wrong, what they're doing right. But I've made it, guys, and we've made it. And credit to all of you. You know, uh, recently we lost Tom Moore, Captain Tom Moore. Um, he was 100 years old and he was a hero. Long before Kobe came along, he was a hero. But he was even more of a hero with all the things he did to stand up to this virus. Um, and that's sad, of course, but life goes on and hopefully he's inspired people. He's inspired a lot of people, I know that. So hopefully that lives on. Um, and yeah, any negativity about people say, oh, we went to Barbados, so we probably got it there. Um, get, get rid of that thought because you don't want to ruin the legacy because all he stood for was like, you know, similar to the way this vaccine is, is something that is a sign of good things to come. And there's going to be a lot more videos. Yeah, I'm still gaming while I'm in lockdown, uploading to Twitch, live streams, and the best bits are on YouTube, or will be. Uh, so far, one video um, of the best parts. Um, but yeah, I want to get back to the podcast, or some form of podcast, or thing where I just talk for 20, 30 minutes. Not an hour, I can't be doing that. I realise it's just pointless. Um, thank you, you know, thank you for sticking by me the last year. Um, it's been tough for all of you. Maybe I've helped you through it. Um, but yeah, obviously recently I've made so many videos. But yeah, it's just having faith, you know, in yourself. Um, that's probably what's kept me in YouTube this last year because I could have easily just said, nope, I'm quitting. And yeah, I haven't made many, many videos recently. I'm out of practice, I'll be honest. But I just have faith that I can get back to it. Back to making videos like I did before. Um, yeah, things will never be the same. It'll be different, but some things may be for the better. We will see, guys. I want to thank you for being part of this channel. Um, like, share, comment, subscribe. You know, stay up, keep doing what you're doing. Stay humble and just be nice to people, really. That's all I've got to say, to be honest. But yeah, thank you for watching and take it easy, fam. Peace.